Hello, welcome to Let's Get Down to Business with the Prince Rupert and District Chamber of Commerce. We are here to give a voice to our local business owners, entrepreneurs, and community leaders to strengthen and support our local business community and to share the wisdom and experience of longtime business leaders and the fresh ideas and experiences of new entrepreneurs. So let's get down to business. My name is Daphne Thompson and I'm the president at the Prince Rupert and District Chamber of Commerce. And we have established Let's Get Down to Business to give a voice to every entrepreneur, business owner, business manager, influencer in the community and even leader within our community. We'd give a, we want to give a platform for you to speak to one another, to have open conversation. We want to hear your stories. And we'd love to be part of your adventure. We want to find out how we can serve you better. We want to find out what are the, the hidden challenges that you might face. We all know that staffing and recruiting, housing, these things are, are issues that everyone face. But is there something that you might face that is unique to your business? What is different to your business than someone else's? Prince Rupert is a very unique Extra extraordinary little community that I found is extremely loving, forgiving, forward thinking and progressive. And let's get down to business is here to untap and unleash that potential that we have. This is a platform where we can make a real impact and we can have a voice where the small and home businesses can actually interact with our MPs or with the city, or with our, our real leaders within this town. We want to give the opportunity and be part of the conversations that have impact, that initiate change, and to have anything that you can possibly think of. The world is our oyster. Prince Rupert is, is just growing and just getting to that point where we are a real force to reckon with. And who is it better to share it with than our business community? This is what our, our podcast and Let's Get Down to Business will be all about. We want to have intimate conversations with our business community. A lot of the things that we've heard is when specifically our home-based businesses or our smaller businesses walk into luncheons or to big conferences and they feel out. They, they feel that there's no space for them. And Let's Get Down to Business is the great equalizer. Everyone is equal on here. Everyone has got their own voice and we want to have those conversations. We want to hear what you have to say. We want to hear more about the, the 2030 vision. We want to know how we can actually practically be part of that vision to make this a better place. Let's get down to businesses here to have those intimate conversations. What are the things that you want to talk about about your business? Get a community that understands the troubles and the, the challenges that each and every one of our businesses face. Ah, oh, yes, we have staffing issues. We have people that just don't pitch up for work. Um, we have always so little time to spend with ourselves and spend with our, our, our loved ones because our business usually takes most of our time. We have funding issues. Uh, Every great entrepreneur has gone through this up and down where then they have all this, this amazing ideas and a community of where they can serve their community with this. However, it comes to a stage where you then just, you don't know what to do anymore. You don't have time. You don't have money. It is consuming your life. You wake up in the middle of the night feeling like an elephant is on your chest. These are the realities that all business owners face. These are the things that no one really talks about that much. What do you do when, when you are at the last end and you, you don't know how to pay your staff this month? What do you do when you really just need capital to get to the next phase of your business? Well, this is the place that we talk about it. This is the place where you can connect with the real influences in our business, uh, in our community that could potentially give you that solutions. I'd really like to share our vision for Let's Get Down to Business. We want to strengthen our community ties. We want to know that and give a platform to know that we're an interconnected community, that we all need one another in order to succeed. We are stronger together 
There's so much more that a community can do when they start collaborating, when they start working together. We want to increase familiarity and we want to hear those untold stories about how your business started. Why did you choose Prince Rupert? How did you, what future do you see for your business here in Prince Rupert? If money was not even an issue at all, or there's no limitations on you or your business, what would you be able to achieve? That is the, the conversations that we want to have a real impact and ignite change within our community because it's really possible. And this is what Let's Get Down to Business is all about. We want to hear you. There is a lot of businesses that that's, does similar things. That's what economic development is. However, there is no one and no business that is exactly like you. No one has your experience. No one has your background. No one knows the things that you have done before. And you've got a specific niche that no one else can serve the way that only you can. And we want to know about it. We want to learn more about that. What is that passion that's inside of you that drives your business forward every single day? Well, let's get down to business and discuss that. So let, let's dream a little. Rising tides lift all boats, right? We're in a very unique situation where anything is possible. We have each other to, to stand on. We've got community that builds each other forward. What is one of those things that Prince Rupert can achieve that no other smaller community has? Part of Let's Get Down to Business is also there to give you solid advice. Actual tips that you can apply in your business and taking it forward. I remember when I started my first business. Um, no one ever told me how lonely that is. I was yearning for another entrepreneur or business owner to act as mentor or to just get what I'm going through, specifically with staffing or with systems that are not working or with the cost of things that I just couldn't figure out in the beginning. But this is a lonely journey. We tend to be our own worst enemies, right? We cr create self-doubt sometimes. We have this thing about imposter syndrome. And these are things that we don't actually speak about, right? But every entrepreneur has had that, even if it was just a flicker of a thought, but has had that thought about, oh crap, I can't do this. Can I really do this? But by speaking about it and being vulnerable, about these business issues that we have, there's someone with a solution. No man is an island. With the right collaborative partner or with the right support in a, in a, real, in a combined together community, you can achieve anything you put your mind to. We see Prince Rupert as this icebreaker that is going the extra mile, is going into a territory that we've not been before. We are just post COVID. Things have changed. We don't know what the new normal is, but the exciting part is we get to create it. So and this is what, what we want to give the platform for. Let's get down to business and speak about the things that we don't usually speak about. We, we want to hear your thoughts. There's so much wisdom and creativity and different ideas that our, our more mature leaders have, as well as the new up and coming generation. Get them talking. What are, what is the possibilities that can get, come out of that? My mom used to always say that the tallest trees get the most wind. When you are doing your own business, when you are an entrepreneur, when you are a leader in the community, you are a leader in this community. You are aiding in the economic development of our community and that's admirable but it is also lonely i'm really hoping and we are really aspiring that let's get down to business can bridge the gap of that loneliness that you can form a community a network of other like-minded individuals that speak the same language that understand what you're going through and be able to to render advice or even just a soundboard because that's majority most of the time what we need as entrepreneurs and as business owners and business leaders. We just need soundboards. We need to feel heard. We want to 
have a say where we're not judged, we're not criticized, and this is a, a safe space. We want to have those conversations to make you feel that it's all right. We all fail at times, we all make mistakes, and let's get down to businesses there to give that platform for you to have a voice and a soundboard and to have a community to talk about it. Having a voice, putting it out there, supporting one another in doing that and listening to one another is how we are able to move forward as a community faster, greater than anywhere else in the world. So join us on Let's Get Down to Business. We'd love to have you as a guest. We'd love to hear more about you. We want to know about your business. We want to know how we, as a chamber or even just as a podcast, can support you more. What are the things that you want to see in your business? What are the things that you want to see in the community? What are the things that you want to see in the future around you? Let's dream big. Let's, let's break the ice. Let's go that extra mile and impact and influence one another to be better. Let's serve one another as a community and let's get down to business. My name is Daphne Thompson and I would love to have a conversation with you on Let's Get Down to Business. Thank you for listening to the Let's Get Down to Business with the Prince Rupert and District Chamber of Commerce. If you would like to be featured as a guest on a future episode, please email us at rupertchamber at gmail.com or direct message us on Facebook or Instagram at Prince Rupert Chamber.